My name is Michael Hahn. I'm one of the machine vision application engineers here at RR Fluity Company. And today we're going to be talking about one of the bigger problems that the packaging industry has, and that is label placement on containers. As you can see in this container right here, having the label placed in the right spot, which we have in this example. And then in this container, we have a label that is up too high and skewed. With our, our Fluity company and Cognix, we're going to be talking about how we can easily implement a solution to fix this problem or to detect this problem in really just a couple minutes. We're going to be utilizing Cognix's micro camera. As you can see here, the bottles will be coming down a conveyor line. We have our lighting illuminating the label on the container with our lens and our camera. And what we're going to be talking about next is how through the software we're going to be drawing the tools to know where exactly the label is placed in regards to the container. Now we have the right images so we can apply our tools utilizing Cognex's Easy Builder software. First thing I'm going to do is go to the locate part in the setup tool section. I'm going to go down here to apply the pattern tool and add this to my image. Next, I move the model region of the area that I want to track and simply hit OK. Crosshairs will show up in the center of the pattern that I have learned. And as we watch other bottles come down the conveyor, we can see that the tracking tool is tracking right, left, up, down, and in the theta axis. Next, I'll be going to the inspect part where I want to apply the measurement tools to find the edges of the labels and the edges of the containers. Go into the measurement tools and apply the distance tool and click add. Through Easy Builder, this is made simple because it's got a function called smart features. It finds all of the edges in the image. So you see that the blue lines are easily highlighting the edges of the label and of the container. The first tool that I've applied here are the edges and measurement tool to find the label in the left and right position of the container. That gives me a distance, as you see up here in the upper right hand corner, of 69.54 pixels. Why don't we take the next step and just scale that into inches? By going into the setup image, Easy Builders made this very simple to go in down to the bottom to the calibration type, select scale, edge to edge, select edges. I'm going to select the same two edges because I know that distance in inches is two. With that simple step, now my whole image is calibrated in inches. I go back up to my distance tool and set the range limit to 2.2 inches maximum and 1.8 inches minimum. So the label has to be from left to right uh, to the edge of the container, a minimum of 1.8 inches and a maximum of 2.2. Next, what I'm going to do is apply the same set of tools, but now for the bottom half. Again, the Smart Features finds all the edges. I find the bottom edge of the container and the bottom edge of the label. And now I can just simply apply the same steps as I did before, knowing that I've already calibrated the image into inches. As we see here where it says distance 2, the distance is 0 0.907 inches. Uh, so we're going to set the maximum at 1.2 and the minimum at 0.8 inches. This is a good container so that uh, as we move and watch the conveyor bring other bottles down the line, you can see 
that all of the distances or the labels are in the correct orientation. The next step is to actually bring a bottle that has a bad label. And we can see that in this image right here. And it highlights that in, the, uh, in this container, the label is up too far. And I have a distance of 1.256. And our range limit is 1.2. This concludes the steps taken or needed to be taken through our, our Flutie company and utilizing Cognex's hardware and software to easily find label position on a container. Thank you.